just too early and it just seemed forced, but that's a fair live, live and learn, man. You live and learn. He's still, he's still a young founder, man. That's a fair read. Um, I mean, assuming he doesn't make the mistake again, I think, but I think, I think most of us understood that Starbucks not turning it on was a possibility, but he led us all to believe it would be turned on. So I think there is, there are mistakes he made and I don't want to like act like he, that didn't happen. I mean, I think there are, there are um, reasonable mistakes and understandable mistakes, but uh, I yeah. mean, it, he did lead us to believe that we would be able to walk into Starbucks and pay with Bitcoin that, and m- all of us like kind of couldn't believe it. And, but I think there is like this, this thing with startups where you feel like you have to escalate and escalate and escalate, especially when you're put on the spot like that at, on stage. And it, it would be also be irresponsible of us not to mention that they did raise a considerable amount of money last year. Um, and I'm not following saying, this announcement, following this announcement. So they would be very, uh,